32, an update now on a breaking news story we've been tracking out of Pawtucket. Within the last 15 minutes, investigators confirming an early morning fire has turned deadly. The pinpoint news tracker shows you where this happened on Summit Street, right near 95 and not far from McCoy Stadium. And we're going to go right to Eyewitness News reporter Alexander Leslie with the brand new information. Well, I just spoke with the fire chief as well as the state fire marshal who tell me that tragically one woman has died as a result of this fire. We know that she lived on the first floor of the home where they believe this might have started. Now, if we take a look here, we can show you that the fire shot up to the top of the home and it looks like the left side of the home, the roof partially has collapsed so far. Right now, crews are working, still working on an exterior attack and trying to put out any remaining hot spots. We know that one firefighter from Pawtucket was trained transported to the hospital as a result of this fire. We believe it's from smoke inhalation at this point. Um, as far as what comes next, the fire chief spoke to that this morning. We're using our infrared cameras to look for any hot spots in the wall to uh, put out any potential fires. We try to keep the scene as intact as we can so that uh, fire investigators can get a, a valid uh, look at the building. Now, I also spoke to some residents this morning who tell me that aside from that one woman, they were able to safely get out of the home themselves. I spoke to a man who actually rang the fire alarm to get crews here. They rang the fire alarm before the smoke alarm even went off because that's how quickly this man responded. We'll have more about his story coming up at noon on Eyewitness News on WPRI 12. For now, reporting live from Pawtucket, I'm Alexandra Leslie, Eyewitness News.